The following question reads that you have uh, which compounds would be formed in the reaction of ethene and aqueous bromine in the presence of sodium chloride. So you have uh, ethene reacting with aqueous bromine and the presence of NaCl. Now for this question you need to know the reaction mechanism of this electrophilic addition reaction where you have an alkene and you have electrons over here in this double bond a pi electron cloud is going to be surrounding this uh, sigma bond in the center and if a bromine molecule approaches this the electrons in the bromine are going to get repelled because of the electrons over here so this bromine will get a partial negative charge this other bromine will get a partial positive charge and this partial positive bromine will then get attracted to the uh, to the electrons in the double bond and this would result in the formation uh, this BR is going to break away the, these electrons over here they're going to get repelled and they would break away and the next step uh, the positive bromine which is plus one uh, because the CL has uh, this BR has broken away with its electrons so it's minus one this is positive bromine now in the next step you have this positive bromine and it's going to attract the electrons in the double bond so these electrons uh, instead of being shared between the two carbon atoms these electrons are going to be pulled towards they're going to be pulled towards this bromine and this would neutralize this bromine the positive charge over here is going to end but a positive charge on this carbon is going to appear because the electrons in the bond have been attracted by the positive bromine so this is now a carbocation intermediate that is going to be formed in this particular reaction now in the next step of this electrophilic addition reaction what uh, what's going to happen is that uh, remember you had a br negative that had broken away so this br with a minus one charge with its uh, extra electrons is going to be attracted and it's going to take its place it's going to be attracted by the positive carbocation but remember in this question the tricky part is uh, that there is NaCl present as well now in NaCl you have Cl minus one ions already present in solution so instead of Br minus one you have another option that Cl minus one ions can also get attracted to this positive carb carbocation so they can also get attracted to this positive carbocation so you, you, you're going to get uh, two products one is either uh, this Br attached on one carbon atom and Br gets attached on the second carbon atom that would result in the formation of option number three where two Br are going to get attached to both carbon atoms the other option is Br get, gets attached to the first carbon atom but in the next step because of the NaCl solution Cl minus one might get attracted to the second carb carbon uh, that was part of the double bond so you can have one br and one cl so the second option can also be correct the first option can't be correct because two cls are not going to be attracted because uh, the first step would be that a positive bromine is going to be attracted to the double bond cl negative is not going to be attracted to this double bond because electrons are going to repel the negative charge on cl so as the first step it's always going to be the first bromine the positive bromine that will be bonded so this bromine over here is always going to be present uh, the second uh, uh, bond would can either be made with bromine or with chlorine so option number one cannot be correct so only two and three are correct so two and three the correct option is going to be option C